Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Alex Thomas here back with another video for you guys today. I'm going to give you guys my um, July Blu-ray haul showing you guys everything I picked up in the month of July. It's another small stack, not nothing too crazy. Just another little small stack. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys everything that I got in the month of um, July. Uh, I know I, just, I know the Criterion sale was this month, and I didn't really get to go to Barnes & Noble at all. My money was, I wouldn't say funny. I had things I had to take care of this month, so I couldn't really go crazy and buy most of the stuff I really wanted to buy. Like I, uh, So you're going to see some stuff in my house like, oh, why didn't you get that? Why didn't you get that? Why didn't you go to the Criterion sales? Because money was pretty funny this month, so I couldn't really go ham like I wanted to. And there's really only a couple things I want Criterion-wise that I can wait till November and get them. Because uh, there is another sale in November. So, um, yeah. So, further ado, I'm going to show you guys everything I picked up. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys enjoy all type of videos, I'm starting to do go back and do walkthroughs again. Maybe I might uh, do, like, live streams and stuff, too, when it comes to video games. Uh, but if you guys enjoy Blu-ray hunting, Blu-ray hauls, reviews, watch-alongs, uh, trailer reactions, all that type of stuff, I do a lot of stuff on my channel. So, I have a different variety of everything of things you can watch and catch. Um, but if you guys are new to the channel, please hit that like one. Please subscribe for more. Um, it's only showing that I think 28% of you guys are subscribed that's watching my channel. And that's pretty crazy. But um, yeah, I hope you guys are ready for that. Uh, if you guys are ready for this video, please hit that like one. Please subscribe for more. And let's get into this video, you guys. Let's get it. Let's go. All right, you guys. Starting off the first thing. It's funny talking about video games. I'm going to show you guys. Uh, my brother, Marquis, shout out to you, man. We went to Half Price Books and he got me Guardians of the Galaxy uh, PS5. Um another ps5 game added to the collection i still haven't played it yet i did download it on my system i haven't played it yet um but yeah i'm very excited to play it because i heard really great things about it um you know it's always good to add more ps5 games to the collection um obviously i'm very excited for spider-man as well so just another marvel uh, video game added to the collection let's get it so yeah um guardians of the galaxy on ps5 right. next we got Rick and Morty season three. I'm slowly but surely buying all the Rick and Morty seasons. I found this for about five dollars, so I'm like, okay, if I can steadily find them around five dollar range, I'll start picking them up. Um, I already have seasons of the one and two, now I have three. Um, so yeah, if I can just steadily buy these surely and surely, I will. Um, obviously, the newer seasons ain't gonna be that cheap, but if I can find like the earlier seasons that cheap and then further along buy the other seasons. I'll be cool with that. So yeah, um, I've never seen an episode of Rick and Morty, um, so I'm only buying it just because obviously it's a, it's a spoof, you know, of uh, you know the characters are reminiscences of the characters from Back to the Future. So that's really more reason why I'm buying it. Uh, but I heard also the show is pretty good. So yeah, um, Rick and Morty season three. Next we got Fortress Sniper's Eye. Um, yeah, it's. I, 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 the only reason why I bought this, for one, it has Chad Michael Murray. I really like Chad Michael Murray, and obviously Bruce Willis. Uh, but I have the first movie. I have the first movie in my collection, and actually, I got this for free because when I went to the exchange, the one by my house, they there. I guess you buy one. They you either buy one, get one free type thing. If the purchase is uh by f under five dollars, I have five dollars. So um, I got this one for free. So I'm not even mad about it. Um, but I have the first movie, and I haven't even watched the first movie yet, so I just bought this just because it's the sequel, and it has a slipcover, which is nice. Um, but yeah, um, I know these movies aren't probably good, but it is what it is. They're probably just stupid action movies. But yeah, um, Fortress Sniper's Eye. Next, we got Babylon uh, with uh, Brad Pitt and Margot Robbie. Um, I found this at the Goodwill for $2.71. Uh, which is not a bad price, which I need to open it. And I think I hear a loose disc in there, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, I do. I do hear a loose disc. Both discs are loose. Wow. I didn't even bother checking them. I just saw that the price was what it was, and I picked it up. But, um, yeah, this is a fairly re a very recent release that I found for basically almost $3.00. And, um, yeah, I couldn't pass it up. Um, you know, I still haven't seen the movie. Heard the movie is pretty bonkers. But, um, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. Um, who is it directed by? Damien Chazelle. Okay. Um, but, yeah, um, Babylon on Blu-ray. Next, we got Natural Born Killers, the other Blu-ray I bought at um, Goodwill. And I know there's a 4K coming out, but... Um, I just said forget it, and I just bought the Blu-ray. Um, like I said, I do like this movie. It's been a while since I've seen this movie, but um, I don't think I need a, 
I don't need a 4K for it. So I just and this is also like three dollars. Um, so yeah, uh, Natural Born Killers, the director's cut is uh, the original uncut version as well. So you know, I'm not upset about it. You know, it is what it is. Um, and I finally have the movie because I haven't owned the movie at all. So that's probably another reason why I bought it as well. And it was only three dollars. So yeah, um, Natural Born Killers on Blu-ray. Next we got heat on 4k if you guys didn't know i don't know if i posted it i know films at home posted it but this was on sale on amazon and i think you also could price match at best buy this was four dollars bruh this was like this 16 quarters bruh that's crazy to think about that um yeah, I, 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 I that was the time to pull the trigger, and I'm upset it didn't come with a slipcover. I did order it from Amazon just because I haven't had time to go to Best Buy, um, especially around this sale. If you guys obviously I didn't make any Blu-ray hunt videos for the last couple weeks, but um, yeah, uh, for it to be four dollars, I said yeah, now it's my time to pull the trigger. I wish I had a slipcover. Maybe if I might go like if I go to Target or something, maybe I might see if they got a slipcover there and switch out. But um, yeah. Uh, this movie is fantastic, directed by Michael Mann, starring obviously Al Pacino, Robert De Niro, um, and uh, Val Kilmer. Uh, this movie is great, and I'm very happy to have it on 4K. I know I heard the 4K was uh, pretty up in the air about how people felt about it. I want to watch it to see for myself, but um, yeah, very happy to have it on 4K. This is the one most people have been asking for, too, and it, it finally released. So yeah, I'm very happy to have it in the collection. So yeah, Heat on 4K. Next, we got Jaws 2 on 4K, um, one of my most anticipated of the month. I did a 4K review on this uh, movie. If you guys have not checked it out, definitely check it out to hear my thoughts on the 4K. Um, I do love the slipcover, though, um, and I do like the steelbook, but I think the steelbook is out of stock now, so I'm kind of asked out on that one, um, but it is what it is. Um, so, yeah, very happy to have Jaws 2 on 4K. Now, are, are Universal, are you guys going to release all the Jaws on 4K? Because you might as well now, since you already released the first two, you might as well release Jaws 4 and Jaws 3 on 4K. You might as well just do it. Just go ahead and do it. Um, so, yeah, um, Jaws 2 on 4K. Mission Impossible, uh, the 4K Steelbook, the new Steelbooks they released. I only have the first one at the moment. Um, I will eventually go out and buy all of them uh, individually. I that was my plan this month was to get one each week because it wasn't really that much this month that I really wanted to get. Um, so I was going to buy stuff like this where it's like, okay, things I didn't get to buy, I was going to buy. Um, and obviously, I only have the first movie. I do want to own all the Steelbooks, even though they released the, uh, the cover for the, the Steelbook for the seventh movie. And, of course, it doesn't match, which we all figured that. But, um, yeah, I, I do like all these Steelbook designs. Um, obviously, I already have them on 4K, and I won't be getting rid of my 4K uh, slipcovers. But it's also cool to have them on Steelbook. Um, so, yeah, uh, Mission Impossible, the 4K Steelbook. And the last thing I got this month, and you guys probably already know what it is, and that is Scream 6, baby. I fucking love this movie. I did a 4K review on this as well. Definitely check that video out as well. But I love this movie, man. I love the Steelbook. Um, one of my favorite of the years. Um, my second favorite of the franchise. Um, and I'm very happy to have it on Steelbook. And also, they released a, uh, they announced the Steelbook for Scream 3, which I definitely will be buying for sure, for sure. Um, but now we just need Scream 4. We need Scream 4. Lionsgate, whoever owns the rights to Scream 4, please just release a Steelbook. Please release a 4K. It's going to look very strange on my shelf to see Scream 1, 2, 3, 5, 6 and no four it's gonna be very strange but uh further ado um scream six the 4k steelbook and that does it for my july blu-ray haul hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys enjoyed this video please hit that like button please subscribe for more let me know in the comment section below what you guys picked up in the month of july i would love to hear what you guys picked up um and like i say also um i have a, a address in the in the uh, description below if you guys want to send me anything to open up on camera i would really enjoy doing that as well um so yeah and further ado hope you guys have a great day and i'm honest with you guys peace out